We continue to take you on a zip trip to Spartanburg this morning. Let's check in with Christine Scarpelli. She had <laughs> cowbells the last time. <laughs> hey, what's up? What's going I on now? Have cowbells. What you got? I have bigger than cowbells this time. I have Riley, <laughs> the biggest personality <laughs> in all of Spartanburg, uh, the Carolinas. Uh, it's a great day to be in Spartanburg, Woo! Christine. Yes. Community relations is just a little of what you do. You tell us all about the Panthers training camp. This is like the only thing we've talked about in every hit this morning. It's a big deal these it, NFL it, players. It, it is a big deal and and beyond being a big deal it's it's the tradition it's and it's Aww. and I think it's the the rite of passage at the start of every NFL season okay. and so it's the opportunity for fans to come to Spartanburg see the team up close and personal and it's just been a really special part of our history and so being able to come back to Spartanburg to get back to a sense of normal for the 2021 season and do something that is it is a tradition is so ingrained and connect with the fans and start the new season it just it means a great deal it's such an accessible thing uh, it and is. that's the thing I mean, it's free yep. and getting there all morning we've talked about the shuttle we've mm -hmm. i mean somebody's riding around on a scooter we should get that scooter over here would you bring that sucker in here okay well as they set up that um you know just seeing those players up close and personal i know with the pandemic a couple of things have changed but you can still enter to win autographed items you yeah, can still and, participate and i think that maybe one of the things that's not normal is with some of the NFL's health and safety guidelines and so um, one of the the most anticipated parts of camp every year is player autographs yeah. which we're we're not permitted to provide that opportunity for fans however we do have a great program in which fans who come to camp uh, come to camp are able to register to win signed player merchandise every day and um, it's a it's been a really exciting part to, to see fans respond to that and uh, walk away from practice with some really cool items. They're still able to be there. They're still, still able still, to see. Still able to be there, see. It's intense too. They're yelling and screaming. Yeah, and I mean, you can you can give a shout out to your favorite player who yeah. might you know point back at you. Really? And so it's just I think um, the, it's that tradition of being on the hill yeah. and watching it all start. It just it just gets you going. It's and fun. so um, but tomorrow night. Uh, Saturday night is a really big night for us, That's and so right. um, NFL back together seven o'clock. You can come out. There's going to be food trucks. There's going to be lots of games and interactive activities for families, for kids. Riley, are you going to be there? Can I come see you? Hundred percent. You're going to be able to see and, Riley. And <laughs> he might give you a helmet. A helmet but, for you. A helmet for you. Right. I'm kidding. But um, practice starts at seven o'clock, and it's in Gibbs Stadium, which it's our f only practice of training camp that's going to be in Gibbs Stadium. Got so it. you've got that great um, venue on. Wofford's campus to watch practice. Don't miss it. Um, gates open at 5:30. We've got, like you said, food trucks, free face painting, stuff for fans to do. Okay. It's really uh, kind of that iconic. We're really into it now. Moment of camp. So we look forward to everyone coming out for uh, uh, the practice tomorrow night. Get on there Saturday. on a scooter. Take a scooter there too. <laughs> so much going on in Spartan, you guys. Back to you. All right. I get like one of these so much for fun. you. Okay. Will he be wearing that blazer? That's a big question. That is one heck of a blazer. One of those two? Yeah. Very looking very dapper. <laughs> we'll have a check of